look, again, an episode. Henry and his associates. No. You're supposed to follow into the script. Oh, sorry. One night, Henry stayed in the uh, tube aisle. And that guy was there. Don't know why you're here, Henry. I don't know. Why am I even here? Hell, you're for my uh, own experiment. Yeah, that guy never been the same since uh, you disappointed me earlier that day. Earlier that day? What do you mean earlier that day? Oh, you know, just uh, typical things like uh, living in captivity, something uh, <sighs> oh man, starting to get sleepy here. Anyway, should we talk tomorrow? Sure. Lights out, Henry. Later the next day, the engines were informed that Henry were gone. So, if that guy even took, a uh, Henry... What'll he even do? Possibly for a model job, I guess? Yeah. That guy did it to me first. Now I'm willingly going to go see that guy. You guys want to join? Yeah! Hey, let's go in! The engines arrived at light speed. Uh, that guy. I have questions. Why is Henry locked between those bars? And, uh... Um, what are you gonna do here? Are you gonna do a model job or something? Yeah. Thomas, Percy, James, and Duck had model jobs. Are you gonna give him a model job? Like we did? Of course. That was what I'm gonna do. Henry's been a bad steamer. He's been a bad steamer years ago. I heard from him. Yeah, I told my entire backstory to all my friends. That never made it. At the time. Okay. So... If you're going to plan to get Henry, what are you going to do? Uh, his drive unit, though, uh, is raised at the point, and his raised drive unit will get him to slow down, and he'll not get up tunnel, he'll not get up, uh, he'll not get up elevation courses, and he'll not go through the uh, bumpy track made in play rail. Wow, you're a very smart that guy. I'm even proud of you never got a uh, model job, though. Well, uh, Creator got me back then. He chewed up the funnel, but he knew better. Oh, man. He quite abused you. What do you mean he abused me? Um, Creator, is this true? Yes, Thomas. Certainly abused that guy, but never abused you. Don't worry, you're still legendary. Thank you. But I want to give Henry a death note. Wait, death note? You sold your Welsh coal earlier. Well, are you serious? Should I give you a flashback? No, Diesel. None of us could even see that flashback. We're not going back to 2018. Yeah, we're done for. It's planning on associates. We do what we want. Anyways, now out of the way, let's get this model job a go. Ooh, this Henry will become newer and newer and newer. Look at that. Now he'll turn into the bestest Henry ever made. What's gonna happen to him then? Will he ever get a complimentary truck? He may have. I knew I got a complimentary Annie and Clarabelle. Then I got a complimentary fuel truck. Then yes, I got Fred Pelley at this point. Well, if I was right here, maybe starting with this year, engines should have complimentary trucks. As they were to say. Oh, thank you, Diesel. You're outsmarting all of us. Even though... Don't tell me many years in the future you'll become four years old at that point. Nah, we'll just uh, give it a go. Diesel. I knew that you're, uh, pointing me out. Uh, Farsi, how about I give you a special way to lose some weight? Lose some weight? But that's how oven, oven side tank engines are built. Um, 
Twelve. You are from a. You were built from an Avaside railway contractor. Quit spoiling. Quit spoiling the fan film. Oh, fine. If no one can tell the backstory, how will we know the backstory if the movie wasn't even released yet? Is this even real? Ladies and gentlemen, engines and coaches, get ready, because that guy has made the new Henry. Yay! I finally got a model job! Thank you, that guy! Uh, no, thank you, Henry. This has been the craziest journey as I ever had. Yeah, I remember that journey either. Oh, great. Is there anything I can do to help? Sure. Maybe I'll try to give in. Hey, Henry, you look even much better. Oh, why, thank you. Do you know your tender on the top looks like you're from the original playroom? Yeah, I know. That's literally something. But anyways, I work better now. I have a drive unit built in me. And now, look at me. I'm more contempted. Whoa. Sorry, that guy. Anyways, I knocked over that guy. And my tender is now liberated. I will have any, uh... Any problems anymore? You're not going to be a co-tender anymore? You're probably... I'm still going to be a co-tender throughout some of the episodes. But it's Penny and Associates. We do whatever we want. We know, Percy. But, hey. At least that guy did a clever thinking. Yeah. Okay. I've gotten headlamps. And those are uh, wheels that were molded on me, and then the uh, shape, and then they uh, put the drive unit, though, built in. Then, yes. And my cab windows are larger. Then, then, yes. You knew about that coal tender thing. And, yes, I gained detail. Even more of that, at least. Anyways. Thomas. What? How about you give me something special to eat? What do you want, Henry? How about we serve some fish? Fine, Henry. Let's go let's go outside and grab some fish. Okay, good. <laughs> Say, it's Penny and Associates. We do what we have what we have can. I'll speak to Henry very soon. <laughs>